Good afternoon, Dan Moylan reporting with Market Movers for Wednesday, April 29th. Stocks were up today on hopes for a coronavirus treatment and extended into the close with support from Federal Reserve Chair Jerome Powell when he indicated the central bank is in no hurry to end economic stimulus. The NASDAQ led the way up 3.6% with shares in Google closing up nearly 9% as investors were buyers based on their revenue gains reported yesterday after the close. The Dow ended up 2.2%, while the S&P ended the session up 2.7%. The National Institute of Allergy and Infectious Diseases confirmed Wednesday that advanced COVID-19 patients recover faster when given remdesivir. This created hope that we have something in our hands that we can combat this virus with, and the results may be enough to lead it lead to its authorization for emergency use. Dr. Fauci indicated the FDA is working with Gilead to figure out mechanisms to make this easily available to those who need it. Investors like this news and prices for Gilead Sciences traded up 5.7% for the day. The Fed Chair press conference today at 2.30 Eastern after the notes were released left investors convinced once again that the Fed's unwavering and creative support to the economy will continue, and Fed Chair Powell indicated once again that the Fed will do whatever it takes to support the economy through this pandemic. Earnings reported after the bell for Microsoft, Facebook, and Tesla. These were all strong. Microsoft said quarterly profits and revenue rose as COVID-19 had minimal impact. Shares are trading up 3.5% after hours. Facebook and Tesla both reported after the bell as well with strong sentiment driving their prices higher by 10% after hours. These earnings will be market movers tomorrow and we'll get numbers from Amazon and Apple tomorrow along with many more high profile companies. Jobless claims will be released at 8.30 Eastern in the morning with analysts expecting a $3.5 million adder to the claims. That's it for today. Have a great Thursday and stay safe.